Yo, what is going on, guys? This is your boy L, L Excels. Excels is the game, Excels is my name. Make sure you guys do something to excel your life today. But guys, I always talk about the benefits of what's gonna happen when you start leveling up, you start improving your life in every way, shape, or form. Whether it's talking to girls, you're becoming more sociable, you're becoming more approachable, you're becoming more, you know, just happy off life, like you're high off life naturally. You don't need to roll up a blunt. You don't need to roll up anything. You don't need to take a drink. You know, you just feel naturally happy. But guys, as you improve, guys, it gets lonely at the top. I'm gonna be straight up with you. You're gonna start noticing signs from people and situations that it's gonna indicate that you're on the right path to success, that your life is projecting the correct direction. You know, it's a, it's a bull market. You wanna keep going up. You wanna keep projecting upwards, right? But guys, I'm letting you know, like this is not for the weak, okay? It only gets, as I've been leveling up guys, as personally me, from my own testimony, from what I've been through in my life, I've noticed that when you start leveling up, you, life gets harder, okay? Life, it, it doesn't get easier. Yeah, you hit a new goal in your life, you hit a new pinnacle, like a new lifestyle that, that you're living now. Like before you were living more, you know, you didn't give a, like a damn about anything, right? And you should, and when I say that, I mean like you didn't give a damn about how you were living. You didn't give a damn about how you were taking care of your health. Maybe you were smoking all the time. Maybe you were drinking, eating fast food all the time. But you know, you made a change, right? As you get older, it gets harder, right? It gets harder to maintain that diet. You're like, damn, you know, I want to be nice to have a burger on the weekday. But you're, you're true to who you are. You're true to your goals. It gets harder. Okay, guys? So understand that if you notice these signs, it, it, this is only for the good. Okay, let's jump right into this, guys. The number one sign that you're on the path of self-improvement, of bossing up your life, is each level, each pinnacle you hit, each goal, each like new you know, area in your life that you're tackling and that you're improving and you're overcoming this, the circumstances, guys, people are gonna start leaving like one by one. You're gonna notice that you're gonna be like more alone nowadays. And you know what, bro? You need to enjoy that. You need to embrace it actually. Being alone, especially as a guy out here, because mo most guys, they have to be surrounded by people. These are feminine guys. These are guys that are insecure in who they are, but that, that's not you, bro. Nowadays, you probably, you probably find yourself more alone because people don't really think like you. People don't have that work ethic, that work drive like you. Well, like, guys, you guys, you young men that watch the channel, you guys probably like, you know, you wake up six, seven o'clock in the morning, go to work and then, or go to school or whatever. And then after afterwards, you're nine to five or, or after school or whatever, right? You're still working. Okay, maybe you're going to practice, you're going to football practice, you're going to training, and then you're going to practice, and then you gotta eat right, and then you gotta walk home, and then you gotta do some homework, or let's say you're doing your nine to five, right? You go, you leave work, you go to the gym, you get out of the gym, you read something, you do some little research on something, then you start working on your side pro projects or side businesses or whatever, right? You're gonna notice that it's only you that has that kind of work drive. Everyone else is cool just going out all the time, you know, linking up with, with the boys after work, or, or hitting the bar or, you know, going out every, every weekend. They, they, you got to be surrounded by a group of, of biddies, right? To, to make yourself feel, you know, like you're having a good life. And guys, you don't want to live your life like that. You want to live your life where, you know, you work hard or you sacrifice. Guys, great things come with sacrifices. If you think that you're not going to have to sacrifice for whatever you want in your life, whatever your goal, whatever your passion is, whatever you want to achieve, guys, you're going to have to make some sacrifices one way, shape, or form. Some of you guys are gonna have to sacrifice your love lives, right? Like, guys, like, I, 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 no, most men that are successful, you know, when, when they were younger, like in their early 20s or teenage years or even like late 20s or early 30s, guys, most of these guys have been single and spent a lot of time by themselves, guys, because it takes all this energy. It takes all this time to focus and dial in on what you want to do. You can't have no distractions, guys. Right? Okay, that's the number that's the that's the number one sign you're on the side on the path to rejection. And guys, number two, you're gonna notice that, yeah, since you lose people, and you know it sucks because you lose some friends, you're not talking to friends as much anymore. Uh and when I say that, guys, there are gonna be friends that are gonna, you know, they're gonna lose contact with you because they understand that you're grinding and they're like, all right, bro, I see you. 
and maybe they're not ready for you know to go go running at the speed that you're running in self on self improvement, but they eventually they want to, right? And it, we all have our own steps, our own journey. It's our own lives, right? And don't ever compare yourself to another guy. I always got to say that. And you're always going to lose people too that because people envy you. Because people look at you and they see that the progress you're making and whatever you're going in in life and however you're doing it, people are going to see like, damn, yo, this guy is really putting in work. People ref do self-reflections when they see you guys. And they should have never do that, right? They should, all you have to do is focus on the man in the mirror. And then you will be happy. That's when life gets easier. When you start caring about what you're cousins is doing what your best friends doing or your whatever whoever whatever in life that's when life is it's it's a, it's a contest and you, and you shouldn't live your life like that but number two you're gonna attract like-minded people right let's say you go out right you're gonna attract like 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 this is the perfect example when you're at the gym you know you're like by yourself you're hitting a rep you're gonna have like a like-minded brother that thinks like you like he might approach you pause but he might you know ask you a question like, yo, bro, like, uh, like, like I, guys, this happened to me. Like I, I met guys before Paul's, but I met like-minded individuals that like, you guys just, you know, you ever just look at somebody, you're like, yo, you know, this is a cool guy. This is a confident guy. Like he, he, he probably got things going on in his life. Right. We, we think like, it's just kind of guys, it's just masculinity exuber exuberant off each other, guys. You're using each other's energy and it's just, you know, Cause in this world, guys, it's rare to come across a masculine, you know, masculine guys, you know, hardworking guys. So when you brothers link up for whatever reason to, to whatever, guys, it's just a good time. Like people are gonna talk about business opportunities, ideas, you know, and you know, girls are just gonna be attracted to that too, guys. And that's another thing. You're just gonna attract girls naturally. Attraction gets so easy. Like I, guys, You'll go out with the mindset wherever you go that, you know, you're just going to attract girls. It, it is what it is. And it gets to the point where it gets annoying, where you're actually going to have to start ducking some girls because you're just like, all right, you know, these girls, obviously, like, you may be an attractive guy to them and they, they you know, and they might want to just flock towards you. And most of them will, oh, especially you got some self improvement, but you shouldn't be worried about that. You, what you got to be worried about is what you got to get done for the day, what your goals are, what the future plans are, okay? As men, that's kind of how we base our lives, right? We, we, we're planners, we're thinkers. We, we plan accordingly for the future, uh, investments. Guys, we just always look to the future, right? When we look at girls, we look at their past. That's a whole other video, all right? I may make a video about that tomorrow. But guys, yes, self-improvement, it, get, it gets lonely, bro. People are gonna leave you, but don't worry, bro. Other people are gonna come your way you know, people that are going to want to see you win, people that are going to want to build with you. And that's great, bro. And, you know, you may even have some friends that are already about self-improvement. Great. Keep them around, guys, because we are the few. We are the, the we are not the many. I'll be straight. Up, we are not the many. We are the rare commodity. That's why people always just are just trying to chill with you. They're trying to chill with us, right? Or people are trying to see you. People are trying to ask you questions. Because they're trying to get game, bro. They're trying to grow like you and become a better person. And it's all love out here. Give, give, bro, bro. Give people advice. Show them blueprints. Because that's what it's about, guys. It's about helping each other grow. It's about helping each other get on the path to success. So we all live abundantly. That's the mindset, guys. Abundance. So yes, guys. I appreciate if you made it this far in the video. I've told you guys I didn't want to make this one too long. Uh, it's getting pretty late out here. But appreciate you guys. I want to see you guys excel. If you haven't already, like and subscribe to my channel. Follow my IG, follow the Twitter. Check out those links in the description down below. Appreciate y'all boys and let's, let's excel, man.